Herzlich willkommen zurück bei uns auf der CMT. Welcome back to CMT Digital. And the next company on our agenda is Uwe Ganter Reisemobile. And to my left hand, I have a genuine expert on this. Kemper Toby, you are going to guide us through this uh, point on our agenda and will have us participate in the innovations and uh, what is in store for us in the future. Thanks very much for these nice words of introduction, and I'm mainly happy that I'm able to uh, represent Uwe Gante today. Um, he's Basic, they're basically based between Paderborn and Kassel for now 30 years. It's not a newcomer company with own brands, but an institution by now. It's a claim which is justified. It's, uh, they might even have their own highway exit. I mean, we have many brands, three floor plans or model variants um, will be introduced here today. And we have picked completely new 21, 20, 20 models. And um, you might already know this information from his website or from the trade fairs. I am impressed. I was just uh, looking at these vehicles on site. So the quality is really high, a premium quality. We have a lot in the equipment range. We can have um, AC systems running at standstill, which is interesting for dog owners. So many things which are important today. Lots of models, a huge variety, and the cost-benefit ratio is also quite good. And um, I'm now going to guide you through my the presentation here. Uwe Gante, 28 different floor plans with um, four brands, exclusive brands, um, I must add. We are going to start with the Miller while we still see a few pictures here from the exhibition area. Here you can see the Miller, is it? Is that the correct slide? That's the angular kitchen with three flame burner. Um, and the drawers have auto close function. I will, of course, show you nice um, movies where you can take a look at this. That's the Jotty Line Terry 37, one of the most sold uh, models with the traditional floor plan, which has been on the rise for the last few years. Um, low profile, seven meters with twin beds and a large rear garage, so a lot in store for everyone. The bikes are getting into the rear um, garage. You can really keep your things in order thanks to that. Everything is fully equipped. Uh, so everything on board when you drive off. No requests open when you start off. You even have the camping table with the camping chairs and different variants, different model variants here. So I will just comment the models while it goes. The Jotty Line is a fully integrated um, um, and vehicle, and um, the lines, well, it's just it's, it has its own phase, brand phase. Here we see a Mercedes, quite new in the portfolio, the Swamp. It belongs to the Bravia. It's the 699. It's excellent with two people because you can have a regular equipment but under 3.5 tons. Of course, with the all-wheel drive equipment, it's heavier. Here we see the rear area. We see the AC system in the ceiling. And here we must add that it's really practical. You go shopping in the summer. You have your pets on board, because many campers do, or um, dogs, cats, whatever. And so you can leave them with the air conditioner system on for two hours without having um, to run the vehicle on the engine. That's the Jotty Line, very uh, nice castle in the background. So nice uh, background. It's based on the Citroen and the Fiat vehicles, so we can take your pick. 
In Fiat, we have the nine-speed automatic transmission we have all heard of because it's also on the run rise. It's really um, popular in the camping sector. That's the interior of the vehicle, which um, here we see the queen's bed alternative. We have the 28 different floor plans, so for everyone there's something in store. Depending on the brand, depending on the model version, we have either the Miller or Dotti line. Bravia Mobil, we'll see a few pictures later. That's the van, camper van. I don't like the panel van um, expression because it doesn't pay tribute to the beauty of these camper vans. The nice uh, swan. And here we see a low-profile semi-integrated motorhome. You get them with or without power lift beds. Even here, if you have the twin bed version, you can have another bed converted by converting the seat group without needing to pick the power lift version because that adds to your payload. So these are things we all know when we choose our models. But um, with Gante, with these brands, you have a really wide portfolio. That's an aerial view of the company. They have a good service. Um, they're doing ceiling tightness tests. You no longer need to do that on site. But someone comes to you, comes to your home, does the testing, and might do small repairs. So that's really something that um, stands out as far as customer service is concerned. Every vehicle um, is handed over correctly. Usually the customers arrive the previous day and leave the next day. Maybe they spend the night in the camper because questions come up when they stay overnight. And that's very important to me, that the service, customer service is big. It's not only good to buy a good vehicle, but also to get uh, excellent customer service as you hope for. So I don't know if I have to push this device to get the next slide. Here we see the Miller Toronto in all its beauty. It's a semi-integrated motorhome again, the traditional system. The next pictures should be coming up uh, in a few seconds. So this is the Miller Toronto, the interior, a vehicle without power lift beds, and there's lots of windows. That's a characteristic that you really have um, light flooded interiors. Very important purchasing criterion. And still you have the antennas on top and the satellite dish. Um, you can, of course, use navigation systems, whether they're big or small. You can have traditional S satellite dishes with TVs at the front and rear. We have bed extensions. We know these from the twin bed vehicles where I can insert interim cushions to get a huge um, sleeping surface. This is a nice exterior view. The vehicles have a five-year warranty and a full um, warranty and um, um, coverage. We um, have more safety and security regarding environmental impact, hail, and so on. It has a longer service life. And that's um, a gaze onto the kitchen. In this model, it's the layout is the kitchen is on the side. We also have an angular kitchen. You can take a look at this on the website. The bath view. What's interesting here is that the wash basin is above the vanity cabinet. Oh no, sorry, the wheelhouse. So the wheelhouse is not in the way of the shower tray. It, you can still take your shower use the wash basin, and you have enough room to use the toilet as well. So bath windows, always very important. Bravia Swan, we already mentioned that. Now we see it here um, based on the Peugeot. And to be honest, I took a closer look at these three vehicles downstairs. Really good quality they're producing here. The brand um, has been sold by Uber Gante for the sixth year in Germany. 
or you can even say Europe. The, um, I'm really um, impressed by the craftsmanship. I love to um, go take closer looks at um, the interior and the exterior, and I must say the, the overall package, which starts at 47,000 euros, and with a fully equipped, you have 53,000 or in, in that range, but you have everything in for that price, and you really have to look for that uh, elsewhere. So I'm really impressed. Here we have a fold-out table, which is obligatory, so that the front passenger also gets to join the table. Anti-scratch surfaces, rounded corners so that you just don't bump into it with your hip. Many details, soft clothes, doesn't, doesn't need to be added nowadays. It's almost uh, obligatory. The fridge is something I noticed. Uh, we criticized it um, sometimes that you had to bend down to open the fridge. But that's the new version by Ted Ford. It's quite high. I have a place to store things on top. I can put my coffee machine on top. And I still don't have to um, bend down that much. And, and you, you can just conveniently take out your food. And I really like the drawers as well, several small draw drawers. This front apron you see here, um, the racing bumper, is not a standard equipment, but Uwe Gante can, of course, order that optionally, which gives it a more sportier appearance. Um, and then the swan will become a quick starter. It's um, really want to get a unique selling proposition. So. This hasn't been integrated in the prices I just mentioned. We have um, LED daytime running lights in these vehicles as standard equipment. We don't have the standard plastic steering wheel, but the com comfort steering wheel, a little bit of leather on top, because it conveys a sort of em an emotion. Because if you have a decent steering wheel in your hands, you are away from this van uh, segment. And you see the edge here again it makes it easy for you to go down go into your, get into your seats. Armrests are obligatory. We, of course, have um, equip, all equipped with the, um, with the um, um, curtains that you draw, with the blinds that you can draw from the top or from the bottom with nice through-looking features. The bathroom of the Bravia is 1599. We have it with longer versions as well. Here, because of the time, we had to pick three out of 28 floor plans, but this is a good one, I think. Here you see the shower without having curtains that stick to your body. So it's not real glass because it would make it too heavy. We have to think of this three and a half ton area, but it's a decent material. You have this thin door that you can slide close. And I have a I'm two meters high or tall, and I can still conveniently stay stand in this shower. So we're looking forward to what the future holds in store for us, as far as Uberganta is concerned. The toilets are really comfortable. You can leave the wooden slates inside, which gives it more um, safety features as well. And the wash basin is also very comfortable. The fittings are very solid. Many mirrors available, a lot of storage capacity available. And I really felt at ease when I entered this. And I see um, we have to watch our time. Anything else you would like to add from? Well, we looked at the Swan 599 and then the Miller Toronto. I'm used to speaking a lot, but uh, at some point in time, I need a glass of water and the Thierry of Jotty Line and everything else can be inspected on the website. And now, it was just to give you an overall impression. Yes, you successfully did so. And now um, my colleagues show me whether more questions have come up. And I'm given a comment that everything that comes up as far as questions are concerned will be directed to the brand space. So that the colleagues from Uwe Gante can be directly answering these questions today. So um, we're no longer asked to respond to these questions. I would like to ask or point out to you at home, please make use of this feature. Um, especially with this 
It's a bitter. We have uh, lots of different uh, models and variants. Make use of the chat. chat. Ask your questions in Uvaganta's brand space. And we have someone on the other end responding to your questions immediately. Give you feedback on all open issues. Toby, anything else you would like to add? An important ja, message you want to convey. Yes. In the next few weeks and months, I will be covering these uh, vehicles on my YouTube channel. Um, I guess you can relate to that as CMT Digital. It's really nice to have this format for the CMT, and I would really like to praise that. Also, on behalf of Overganta, it's excellent that we can reach you campers at home during these great times. Times will improve, and we will be camping, and we will hear the honks um, when we get back into the, our freedom. It's very difficult for this segment, and um, I really like your digital approach here. I have a YouTube community, and um, we are influencers, as we're called. That's a term that was branded. Um, we just can look ahead and um, really a chapeau to the Stuttgart trade fair. It's a step that was really necessary, and I believe we'll be able to um, master all of that. Ask your questions in the chat, and then we can approach the future together. All right. What shall I add to that? Uh, thank you for your nice remarks. And uh, please make use of the chat. We will be doing a quick cleaning here and then continue in a few minutes with the next innovations. Thank you very much.